Hare Krishna, Namaste. I hope you're having a blessed morning. I hope you're feeling, feeling loved, feeling appreciated, even if it's only by yourself, because <laughs> you are the universe, and you, no one deserves your love more than you. So yeah, I hope you're having a good morning, or if not, I hope it, you can turn it around, I'm sure. Oh, it's good to be here with the calendar today. Feeling very grateful. Ooh, Hare Krishna. Krishna is present in his Galuka Vrindavan, in his Dharma. He does not go out, but his expansion goes out and takes, accepts the service of the devotee. Krishna can expand his hand. He himself comes. Svayam Iva Svarati Ada. Krishna becomes manifest to the devotee. Taken from a lecture by Prabhupada on the nectar of devotion. I'll get into nectar in a minute. <laughs> I like the nectar. Right. Krishna, Galuka Vrindavan is a higher, higher planet, higher dimension, higher spiritual plane, uh, a different level of existence, and and Krishna is always there. That's where he lives. That's where, that's where he always is, no matter what. And but he is saying he can reach, he can reach out from there. At any moment and does in every moment parts of him reach out to us and that's kind of like us lining up with our prayers and with our manifestations and with our reality is is that hand reaching out and every time we do something good for each other for the for the, for the community for the environment for any time we do anything that's from love and that's good Krishna, all that is, the source, loves that, you know, it embraces that, it will reach out and and receive that offering that you're giving, like a hand, that's what it's saying when it says he, he can expand his hand, and it's like every time you do something, you're giving an offering, and every time you do that, the universe is there, grateful with its hand out, ready, Krishna is there, grateful with his hand out, ready to receive your offering, your gift today, now. Even the smallest morsel is, is treasured by Krishna, by that source, that consciousness, that love. It, it grows with every little offering that we do. And, and it's really cool, really good to, to know consciously as you go about your day that everything you do is an offering you know every single thing you do is an offering and every single time the universe is grateful and yeah I've said it before but we all add to the richness to the beauty to the wonder to the awe that is this reality, this world, this dimension that we live in, and we're adding to it. And even on a, even on other dimensional levels, we're we're having a big impact with the smallest things that we do as we go about. Everything that we do adds up, you know. So yeah. So when it says about his dharma, is it Galuka Vrindavan in his dharma? Dharma is the teaching is the knowledge, is that deep down knowledge that I'm talking about. And if you can carry that with you in your day, it will just enrich your life a lot to know that it's all an offering. And I mean, a lot of people know this anyway. You know, a lot of us have realized that there's more to our reality than just the physical world, that energetic vibrations, like vibes is in what, what energy we're putting out. It counts, it matters, it makes a huge difference. You know, a lot of our communication with each other and with the world is done 
vibrationally by what energy we're feeling and what we're thinking about and then that will put out this weird non-physical energy that people will pick up on and it will change them you've seen it happen people change right in front of you for good or for bad because of the energy we're putting out so to go about your day knowing that everything's an offering and knowing that the universe the the deity the the consciousness that you're offering that to is always ready and always accepting and grateful and honors your gift each and every time you know and if we can realize that and not let our thoughts about what we're doing get in the way if we look at it properly like that then it can make a big difference to ourselves to our own mental health to to the people that we meet and talk to, it'll make a difference to them and it'll make a difference. Domino effect, yeah? So let's get out there and spread some good vibes and make some offerings. <laughs> I love you and I wish you a really happy day. Yeah, no matter what you're doing, make it a happy one. Much love, yeah? Stay blessed. Hare Krishna.